Connecticut to be part of this, you know, uh, great uh, interview. Uh, we didn't have enough seats to have them up here with microphones initially, so, but we wanted to save the best for the last. And, and uh, Jack, tell us a little bit about your involvement with the parade over the uh, years. Well, it was a uh, family by the name of Kelly, Mike Kelly and Jane Kelly, and years ago, Mike uh, uh, got me involved in a parade, I would say generally the late 90s, and I loved the parade. I, as a kid, came with six other brothers from Manhattan. Every March 17th, we would take the train down to 72nd Street, cut across East 72nd Street, through the park, and there was more noise, and there was a parade second to none. So when I got involved in this parade up here, it was like, wow going home. I said, these guys, uh, I was so impressed with the parade early on that I penned a letter to the Poughkeepsie Journal telling them what a great idea. I mm. thought the parade is only in New York, but here <laughs> I am in Dutchess <laughs> County at the parade. Yeah. So anyway, my first recollection yeah. of the parade was I'm in the theater business, and there was a very powerful dog named Spike. All the kids knew Spike. And Spike was in the theater, and I happened to get a friend of mine in the theater to get me Spike. And believe it or not, I walked Spike <laughs> in a 1999 parade, and you would press one button, his ears would pop, you press another, the tongue, and I I go over to the kids with this with this dog, and they would love the dog. And I would love watching their faces and seeing the beauty of these innocent kids really sitting there enjoying this parade. So that started me into this whole process. <laughs> then there came a time where I was asked to be Grand Marshal. Hmm. Bill, I have to tell you. When I found out, I was, I, was, I was crying. I woke up in the middle of the night, I said, Grand Marshal, why? Now, you have to understand, turning back the clock a little bit, 1960, there was an Irishman by the name of Kennedy. And he, he became the President of the United States. I don't know what party he was, but he was an Irishman. And guess what? When I saw him walking up Pennsylvania Avenue with the top hat, I said, you know what? I'm going to get a, a tuxedo and a top hat, and I'm going to walk this parade. And ever since that day that I walked that parade, the growth of the parade over mm -hmm. the years, through the committee, through people like Gene, through people like the English Bees, through people like the Costellos, to John... And let's turn back because Bill is, uh, I can go back where Bill's <laughs> family, the Hollihans, mm -hmm. had their own banner mm -hmm. and it said the Hollihan clan. And guess what? There was a ton of them. I thought it was the <laughs> Fenegas, but it, it, they outnumbered us, you know? But, but that's my recollection, Bill, mm -hmm. and that's why I felt, wow. You know, he came every year, emceed our parade, emceed <coughs> our, uh, uh, where we take the Grand Marshal and give him his ash, the Emerald Ball. And I said, wow, he earned it. He earned it. God exactly. Almighty, he earned it. So, Bill, I hope that that day is as joyful for you as it was for me. And I, I'm the luckiest guy on the planet. I, if I... If I go tomorrow, it doesn't matter because I, I, I achieved many things, but that parade, being the Grand Marshal, being almost a Jack Kennedy, you know, for a day, mm. you know, yeah. <laughs> meant the world to me. So I'm hopefully that your children and those boys, I'll tell you one thing, if you want to sell them, I'm a buyer, yeah. $5 million. <laughs> 
He's Cash. grooming them well. You know, I, you know, you had <laughs> they have Liam, the right, right names. They have the right yeah. names. Yeah. And when Bill got the sash put on, Liam was there. That's right. right. Amen. Yeah, it was great. Amen. Scene. You know, to uh, to Liam Patrick and Sean Thomas. Yeah. Uh, this is Uncle Jack. Uh, <laughs> Jack. Fedigan. And he gave me the five. He yeah. gave me the fist. Jack uh, Fedigan, uh, with no exaggeration, is uh, a legend uh, <laughs> in the community uh, for many, many reasons and many things, and uh, this parade being one of them. Uh, Jack's involvement I've seen, obviously, since the very beginning, and you know, you mentioned that uh, walking that robotic dog around. I remember that. Oh, boy. I remember you doing that. It was a highlight. I still have yeah. them, too. Yeah, yeah. So, uh, you know, it, it's an honor to uh, to stand alongside people like Jack. And uh, when I heard uh, that uh, uh, Jack Fedigan was, and I heard that Jack would be contacting me to let me know I was in nomination, okay? And then when I heard from Gene that I was selected, I, I got to say, uh, it meant so much uh, coming from those two, uh, <clears throat> you know, strong Irishmen uh, who have held this committee together. Well, it's certainly our pleasure to have you because you uh, are what the Dutchess County Parade is all about, you know, and uh, you'll, you'll do just fine and your family will oh, knock yeah. it out of the park. Now, of course, the next question was, uh, after they told me I was the Grand Marshal, they said, well, who are we going to get to MC the parade? <laughs> now, now for, me, for me, it was very simple because I had already thought about this. Uh, Joe Daly, uh, the morning mayor, now retired, uh, uh, legendary broadcaster uh, in the Hudson Valley, uh, former Grand Marshal, uh, has since relocated to, uh, I think, the Poconos. Pennsylvania. Right. Um, I said, Jack, uh, without question, the person who should be invited to do this is Joe, and somehow uh, Jack was able to uh, mm. make this happen with well, Joe Daly. So. Yeah. Well, Joe, uh, Joe is a special guy. Yeah. You know, like uh, Bill says, the morning mayor. Yep. Uh, and I don't know if you know it, we took 25 years of parades and we put something together and Joe was kind enough to take us up to his studios, had his uh, sound man, and he announced that whole 25 years. And wow, that was powerful because Joe, as Bill, has a special voice, you know? a special calling. I don't know how this guy does everything he I does, but he makes me look like I'm not even a volunteer, yeah. <laughs> you know, as much as he does. Yeah. But that's right. another story. But Joe came, he came uh, uh, from Pennsylvania. He was terrific. He will be at the parade, yeah. so come on out to the parade. Right. And tell uh, Joe loves the parade anyway, you know, but he'll be there and uh, he does a wonderful, wonderful job as almost as good as Bill, <laughs> but that's okay. <laughs> no, Joe, Joe is uh, a, a mentor uh, to he's, me, and uh, he's, he's certainly uh, been uh, uh, doing voice work a lot longer than I have, and for him to come into the Emerald Ball, number one, and then yeah. come into uh, the parade itself is, is a blessing, uh, uh, and it will be greatly sure appreciated. Yeah. Well, let, you know, we're going to close this session, and thanks again to Mike Miner, thanks to Gene and Jack and Bill, and. <laughs> Everybody, all the people that put their hearts and souls into this uh, event. And uh, I think uh, this will be the best one yet. And hopefully maybe next year we'll have 200 pages. In <laughs> and don't forget, yeah. the journal propels the parade. It does. So it does. look in the journals. Yeah. We print uh, over a thousand copies. Right. And go to the people and say, hey, thanks for supporting our parade. Exactly. Yes, and also, uh, uh, speaking of Mike Miner and video production and, and the town and the village working together collectively, uh, the parade again uh, will be recorded so that we can make it available yeah. on the uh, cable network uh, and wow. on our website. Yeah. Uh, but there's nothing better than being there in person. Exactly. So Amen. be there Amen. on March 4th, witness this gala event. Uh, certainly something I'm never going to forget. Um, being there in person, actually walking the route uh, for the first time in 25 yes, years. that's right. Yeah, I uh, hope I can make it. Uh, <laughs> normally I'm standing in the same place, uh, but it's going to be fun. incredible. Well, but, I've well, seen you 
walk parades, yeah. pulling a little red wagon with your son. I'm bringing them. So you're I'm, gonna... I'm bringing my leprechauns yeah. uh, and my beautiful yeah. Irish wife uh, yeah. to the Amen. parade. That's great. Well, uh, so come on out, everyone. Have a great time on March the 4th in the village of Wappinger Falls, and we'll look forward to seeing you then. Thank you. Thank you, gentlemen. Thank you. Thank you, Thank you Super. Bye-bye.